sun is starting to peek through and spring is underway. But nights are still cold, especially for those living on the street. Jenny Ramsey with the Catholic Action Center has seen people on the toughest of nights, counting more than 6,000 total stays at the Safe Harbor Lighthouse. These are human beings that otherwise would have no place to go. That doesn't count the people that are living in their camps or the people that won't come in, the people that are, you know, living in their cars. It doesn't count the families and people that we can't serve there. From December 8th to March 31st, the Safe Harbor Lighthouse opened its doors for those in need each night. Providing warmth for hundreds of people throughout the coldest months, their doors will close Friday. We are full. Hope Center's full. Salvation Army's full. Everyone has been experiencing full and overflow. Although she says she hasn't seen a decrease in homelessness in Lexington, they're working with the city to gear up for the future. We've done the model. We hope that they will understand that they can't deny that the people aren't there that need the help. Since December, they've helped six people get into permanent housing. Ramsey says they do their best to get people IDs, connect them with family, and even get them appointments. We all have to keep in mind each one of these human beings that are experiencing homelessness have their own barriers, their own challenges. They've all got their own story. In Lexington, Julia Sandor, WKYT.